the late chairman of the Social Democratic Front Legion Frundi will be remembered as someone who played a great role in Cameroon's democracy. He narrowly missed the 1992 presidential election and has always rejected the option of walking on blood to access political power. Now, anybody who has lost a close friend, a close family member, has a heavy heart. And when we started with the social democratic options for democracy and freedom to the Cameroonian people in 1990, in 1992, you had the press freedoms. And uh, I think that between the journalists and the SDF, we fought for democracy in Cameroon from thence up till today. But now where we are, that people are being abducted and assassinated. I want to believe that they assassinated them because they are doing their job and maybe they might have made a statement that touched somebody somewhere, somehow. Uh, sitting here in your studio, I'm really, really worried about our country, worried about the world. Although he lives behind a divided party, Nijon Frundi did not see things this way. During a long chat with this reporter a few months back, the chairman said he never had preference for anyone at the helm of the SDF and has been concerned about the well-being of Cameroonians. When the SDF started, we fought for democracy, we fought for the freedoms of, freedom of speech, we fought for so many things in our country. We fought for the rights of teachers. So you journalists should now take up your stance and fight for your own core, for your own core of work. And the other people should stand for their own. Maybe teachers, trade unions, and uh, the other unions should be able to stand as a body to fight for the truth in our country. Today, you're able to talk. I think that some of the things you say in this uh, radio station, you could not say them before 1990. But today, you're able to say them. I believe that we should have responsible journalism and uh, for people to fight for their rights. To Nijon Frundi, the SDF remained committed to its initial ideals and did not at any point adhere to the ideals of the ruling party as many people insinuated.